and today we're going to draw a lighthouse. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use markers. You also need some? Paper and something to color with. All right, let's draw a lighthouse. Yeah. We're first going to start at the top of our paper and we're going to draw the letter L. We're going to draw a line down and then a line across. This is for the top of our lighthouse. So it's towards the top, but also in the middle of our paper. Then we're going to draw an upside down L. This is for the actual light part of the lighthouse. <laughs> now at the top, let's extend each side out a little further. Then we're going to use our eyes to measure the top line. We're going to split it in half, and then we're going to draw an imaginary line up and place a point. Then we're going to connect this line over to the point and then also back down to the other side so we have a triangle. Now at the very top we could also draw a straight line going up. All right, now let's draw the bottom of our lighthouse. We're going to do the same thing at the bottom. We're going to extend out both sides a little further. Then let's draw two diagonal lines and these are going to, going to be a lot shorter short on each side, and then we can connect those together. Almost looks like we're drawing a rocket. Oh yeah. <laughs> then we're gonna draw the bottom. We're gonna draw a line that comes down like this, and then we're also gonna draw a line coming down on the other side, and I'm getting a little further away towards the bottom. Good job. Now let's connect the bottom, and this line could also go out passed on each side also, just like we did at the top. Okay, now let's draw two short lines coming down. This is for the base of our lighthouse. And then we can connect those lines together also. So we have a really short rectangle. Okay, now at the top of a lot of the lighthouses, you can walk around. So let's put a railing up here. We're gonna draw another line that goes across the top and it's the same length as this bottom part of our lighthouse. Then we can connect on the left and also on the right. Let's also add a line right down the middle. This is for the railing and we can also split each of the smaller rectangles on each side. Cool, that looks really awesome. Mm -hmm. Inside this glass part up here, let's draw an oval shape. This could be for the big reflective dish that shines the light around the whole lighthouse to warn all of the ships. Now we could add even more details, but let's leave it just like this. Let's add the rocks now down here at the bottom. Okay. We're gonna draw, let's draw a bumpy line. We're gonna come over and connect to the base of the lighthouse. Oh, I forgot. What we need did to, you forget? <laughs> we need to add a door down here at the bottom. You have to be able to you know, get okay. in, yeah, get into the lighthouse. And so let's turn it on. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> let's do two lines going up and then we could draw a curve at the top. Cool, now let's draw bumpy lines coming down. So this is the edge or the rocky cliffs on the side. Now we could also draw more mountains over here on the side. What's our drawing missing though? Water. Yeah, definitely, we need water. We're gonna start here, we're gonna draw a horizontal line that connects to our lighthouse. Then we're gonna use our imagination and we're gonna imagine the line, this is the horizon line of the water, the ocean, going behind the lighthouse, coming out the right side and going across to the side of the paper. Mine's kinda going uphill, but that's, that's okay. <laughs> Now we still need to do one more thing to our drawing. Color it. Yes, we need to color it. This part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end you can pause the video if you want to match our same coloring. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Mm Give me five. You did such a great job on coloring your lighthouse. We, we colored the whole paper. Mm -hmm. 
There was a lot of color. Are your hands sore? Yeah, very you, sore. <laughs> you can open and close them like this. <laughs> and stretch them out. <laughs> you can pause the video right now to match our same coloring, or you could color your drawings any way you want. Yeah, you could change it to nighttime, or you can add a boat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nighttime would be really cool. You could add the boat way out there in the background. Mm -hmm. And you could also draw light rays coming out of the, the lighthouse. Yeah, that would be cool. We use markers to color our drawings. But you can use whatever you have at home. Yeah, like colored pencils or even crayons. Mm -hmm. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your lighthouse. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun. And we hope you have fun coloring your drawings and also adding different things to change your drawings. We'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Hey, parents and teachers, take a photo of your child's finished artwork and post it on Facebook or Instagram. Also, be sure to tag us in it at Art for Kids Hub. Did you know that we also have a website? You can find it at artforkidshub.com. It has more lessons and information about art supplies we love to use. You can also visit artforkidshub.tv to learn more about our awesome Art Hub membership. The membership includes exclusive lessons and our own apps so your child can learn art in a focused, distraction-free environment.